If you've just started collecting records and now you're looking for your first turntable, here are my top five recommendations. And the links to all of these will be in the video description down below. Number five, the Fluence RT81. This is a great beginner's turntable for many reasons. First, it comes in three colors, piano black, piano white, and walnut. It also has a belt drive motor, which means that the motor is off to one side and it spins the platter using a rubber belt. So that cuts down on motor rumble and gives you a better sound. Now it also spins at 33 and 45 RPM speeds so that you can play both types of modern records. The 12 inch albums like the ones you see on the wall behind me and also the smaller seven inch singles. Now it also has a built-in preamp, so you won't need to run out and buy one of those separately, so that's going to save you some money. It comes with the Audio-Technica AT95E cartridge, which features an elliptical stylus or record needle, which sounds really good. It also has a counterweight at the back of its tone arm for a more accurate tracking force. And finally, it also has a special feature called Auto Stop. So what exactly is auto stop? Well, basically if you flip this switch on on the back of the turntable, uh, then when the record needle gets to the end of the record, it automatically stops spinning the platter. So essentially if you're playing records at night and you're really tired and you happen to fall asleep, it's not gonna just keep spinning all night long damaging your record needle, which is great. So that is a helpful feature. And last of all, as far as the accessories go, it also comes with a rubber slip mat, a 45 RPM adapter, the power cable, the RCA cables, and of course, the dust cover. So overall, a solid first turntable. Number four, the Audio-Technica LP120X USB. If you're willing to spend a little bit more, this is a quality turntable that's durable and is gonna last you many years. First, it comes in three colors, black, silver, and the newer bronze, which looks really cool. It also has a direct drive motor, which means that the motor is directly underneath the platter and it spins it directly. So that's gonna give you more accurate speeds. And speaking of that, it also spins at 33, 45, and 78 RPM speeds. So that you can play the 12 inch albums, the seven inch singles, and even those older 10 inch shellac records also known as 78s. But if you are gonna do that, you will need a special stylus. So just keep that in mind. Now this turntable also has a built-in preamp. So yet again, you won't need to buy one separately, which is gonna save you money. It also comes with the upgraded Audio-Technica ATVM 95E cartridge. So you're gonna get good sound. It also has a counterweight at the back of its tone arm for accurate tracking force. And finally, as its name implies, it also features a USB connection so that if you want, you can hook it up to your computer and convert your records to digital audio files using a program like Audacity. So that's a unique feature of this turntable. And last of all, as far as the accessories go, it also comes with a USB cable, a felt slip mat, the RCA cables, the power cord, a 45 RPM adapter, and of course, the dust cover. So overall, this one has everything you need and is built like a tank. Number three, the Audio-Technica LP3. If you want a no-nonsense record player that's fully automatic and sounds great, this is the one for you. Now, what do I mean by fully automatic? Well, basically with this turntable, you put the record down, you select the size of the record and the speed at which you wanna play it at, and then you press the start button. Now at this point, it will automatically drop the record needle for you, and then when it gets to the end of the record, it will automatically lift the record needle and return itself to the tone arm rest. So overall, this is a pretty convenient feature. Now it also comes in two colors, black and white, and features a belt drive motor. It spins at 33 and 45 RPM speeds. 
It has a built-in preamp, has a counterweight, and comes with the Audio-Technica AT91R cartridge, which does sound good and is comparable to that VM95E, which we mentioned on the previous turntable. And last of all, as far as the accessories go, it also comes with a 45 RPM adapter, a rubber slip mat, the RCA cables, the power cord, and of course, the dust cover. So overall, a great beginner's turntable. Number two, the Sony PSLX310BT. This turntable has two main features that are gonna make your life a whole lot easier. First, it's fully automatic. So basically, just like with the previous turntable, you select the size of the record you're gonna play and the speed at which you're gonna play it at, then you press the start button and it does the rest for you. So you don't need to worry about lowering or raising the needle yourself because it's gonna do all of that for you, which is nice. And the second feature it has that's really cool is the Bluetooth option. So there's a large Bluetooth pairing button on the front of this turntable, and that allows you to connect to Bluetooth devices like a pair of wireless headphones in order to play music wirelessly. Now, I personally prefer the stability of wired setups, but there's no denying that if you're simply going for the easiest setup possible, then this would be the way to go. So if you already have a pair of Bluetooth headphones like these Sony XM3s and you wanna start playing records today, then getting this turntable would be a no brainer. Now, as far as the other features, it comes in only one color, black, but it does look nice. It spins at 33 and 45 RPM speeds. It has a belt drive motor, a built-in preamp, a USB connection. It does not have a counterweight, but it still tracks the grooves of your records just fine. And last of all, it comes with the Audio-Technica ATN3600L cartridge, which does sound good, but is not upgradable, so just keep that in mind. And last of all, as far as the accessories go, it also comes with a 45 RPM adapter, a rubber slip mat, a USB cable, the RCA cables, the power cable, and of course, the dust cover. So overall, if you want a record player that's very easy to use and also has that Bluetooth option, then this is the turntable for you. And finally, number one, the Audio-Technica LP60X. This is hands down the best option for your first turntable for many reasons. It's fully automatic, so yet again, you won't have to lower or raise the needle yourself, which is nice. It comes in four beautiful colors, black, red, brown, and gunmetal. It spins at 33 and 45 RPM speeds, so you can play both types of modern records. It has a belt drive motor, a built-in preamp, and most importantly, it comes in both Bluetooth and non-Bluetooth models. Now, the Bluetooth version does cost a little bit more, but if you absolutely need that wireless feature, then that would be the one to go with. Now the 60X also comes with an Audio-Technica ATN3600L cartridge, which does sound good, but you can't upgrade it down the road. So just keep that in mind as well. Also, this turntable does not have a counterweight at the back of its tone arm. However, it tracks the grooves of your records just fine, and the tracking force, which is the downward pressure of the needle on the vinyl, is not too heavy which is good. So both of these are not a huge deal, but they are worth mentioning. And last of all, as far as the accessories go, it comes with a 45 RPM adapter, the power cord, the RCA cables, a felt slip mat, and of course, the dust cover. So overall, a fantastic beginner's turntable. Now, another important thing you need to know is that in addition to the turntable and preamp, you're still gonna need an amplifier and speakers to make everything work properly. So basically, if you're missing any one of these four items, it ain't gonna work and you can't play records. So with that being said, I'll also drop the links to my recommendations for those items and also some vinyl record cleaning products down in the video description below. So be sure to check those out 
as well. All right, now before we go, today's song of the day is One More Time by Daft Punk. And if you have a suggestion for a song of the day as well, post in the comments down below and you might see it in a future video. Okay, now what was your first turntable? Let me know down in the comments below, and if you love collecting records as much as I do, then feel free to subscribe and smack that bell notification right down there so you won't miss out on any of the new videos. And most importantly of all, have an awesome day, stay safe, and keep spinning that vinyl.